Hi guys, welcome to Rapturous House. My name is Tanya. I hope you all are doing absolutely, absolutely wonderful. Today's reading is going to be for my Virgos. Let's see. I want to see what's going on between you and the person that you've been intimate with. If you haven't been intimate with someone, let it go. It ain't your reading. But I definitely want to see what's going on with my Virgos and the person that they have been intimate with. I do want to thank you all. I want to thank you all for all your likes, all your comments, all your shares. They're all greatly, greatly appreciated. If you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, please do so. That way you'll get notified anytime I upload any new video footages, but also that way I'm able to tug on your energy. Okay, guys, please remember only take what's yours, leave everything else behind. If you would like a personal reading, my website's information is down in the description below. That is the only way that you're able to obtain a personal reading. Okay, all right, my love, we're going to get into this. I want to see what's going on between my Virgos and the person that they have been intimate with. Let's see what's the energy surrounding you guys, okay? All right, I do call on the Holy Spirit. I call on the white light that guides us. I call on the goddesses that gives us our strength and the angels that protect us. Show me what I need to see. Reconciliation and true love. Seeing you again reminds me that life is better with you in it. So for some of you guys, somebody that you've been intimate with, you there's a reconciliation that's happening. And then we have true love. I waited my whole life to find someone like you. Somebody is realizing how they feel about you. Somebody is realizing how they feel about you. Somebody, <laughs> there's some good energy here, like meaning like some of you guys, you shock someone contemplation i've been thinking a lot about us tell me do you think of me too for a lot of you guys you have blown someone's mind yeah for some of you guys this is a past person that's thinking about you but for a lot of you guys this is a new person for a lot of you guys you got a new person all in their head but there is a past person thinking about you as well a past person you've been intimate with we have balance finding balance between giving and receiving why do i feel like somebody is trying to match your energy like i'm getting an energy like somebody and i'm getting like sexually somebody trying to match your energy trying to give it to you just as good as you're giving it to them for some of you guys somebody's struggling to keep up with you for some of you guys, somebody is struggling, strong Libra energy. Somebody is struggling to keep up with you. We have divinely guided. This relationship is being divinely guided and protected. I'm getting like, for a lot of you guys, this is someone new. For a lot of you guys, this is someone new that's been, that's been divinely guided to you. And the feelings that they have for you is strong. It's undeniable. I'm getting like kind of poof, like mind blowing for some of you guys. Yeah. Show me this reconciliation. Wow. Liberation. I'm setting myself free and embracing new experiences. Somebody from your past may set somebody from your past may actually leave someone to be with you says chaser if only there was a way i could make you feel my love yeah somebody's about to free themselves somebody from some of you guys past is about to free themselves from someone here to come chase after you there's a big big energy somebody trying to free themselves from something commitment for some of you guys this could have been somebody you were married to are you in a committed relationship with this person? Let's take it to the next level because nobody else matters. For somebody here wants to, <laughs> like, somebody wants to put a ring on it. Like, somebody here wants commitment. I'm getting, like, somebody here, like, whatever you've done to this person, it's unmatchable. It's unmatchable. It says true love, commitment. It talks about reconciliation. For some of you guys, you got somebody about to leave somebody to come after you. And for some of you guys, you got this new person ready to marry you just so they can have it when they want it. Like that's what I'm getting in this energy, just so they can have it when they want it. Show me this contemplation. 
sacrifice. There's a sacrifice I need to make. I'm not sure if I'm ready. Somebody that can't stop thinking about you knows they have to make a sacrifice. What is this sacrifice? I want to know what this sacrifice is. The sacrifice is. And then we have holding on. It hurts to let go, but sometimes it hurts more to hold on. Somebody's going back and forth, back and forth. Somebody is going back and forth, back and forth. Somebody's hurting their own self because they're, 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 they're stuck between a rock and a hard place. They're stuck between two people. Yeah. Somebody knows they have to make some type of sacrifice. And I'm also getting for somebody, somebody is having to sacrifice their freedom because somebody is not willing to settle for just what they're offering. They're, they don't want to let go, but it hurts to hold on. Yeah. Somebody can't stop thinking about this. Somebody knows they have to make a sacrifice. But you know what I'm getting in this energy? I don't get this person being strong. This is somebody that's weak-minded. I don't get this person being, all this energy is telling me like this person's not going to be strong enough to make this decision. For some of you guys, this is somebody here. This is giving me third-party energy. This is giving me new this is giving me somebody from your past. This could be for all of you guys or just take it. Remember guys, take the pieces of this that resonates with you because I'm getting like three different energies here. Yeah, show me this balance. Rushing in. I can't wait any longer. I'm making a move. Somebody is coming in because they want what you got. <laughs> they want what you got. They want what you what you've given. I feel like somebody is coming in to prove a point is what I'm getting. Like somebody rushing in to come in to prove a point because I feel like how, how does how am I how am I wanting to say this? This is like showing someone out. And it's like this, this, whatever this energy is, it's affecting someone's ego. Somebody's rushing in because this is somebody here that wants to balance the scales. Like this is like somebody here that they got total pleasure, but the other person didn't get total pleasure. So now they're coming back to rectify this situation. That's kind of what I'm getting in that energy. Yeah. Somebody here is coming back in. They want to balance the scales. They're rushing in. I'm getting like somebody here that just wasn't ready. <laughs> they weren't ready for you. We have jealousy. It kills me knowing there could be someone else in your life. Because this person doesn't want you to be with someone else. This person doesn't want you to be with someone else. I feel like for some of you guys, you and this person could have truly had some type of discussion about this. Like... Like after some type of sexual encounter, there could have been some type of sexual conversation. And like, this is like someone here, like prepping themselves, teaching themselves, learning new things because it's like, oh no, I, they like what you're doing to them. They like what they get from you. So they're rushing in to, it's like earning their cool points or earning points with you again. Because they want what you, whatever you do to this person. Look at this snake that's crawling on this lady. This snake is driving me bonkers. <laughs> like this snake is like bothering me. <laughs> but like whatever you do, you're touched to this person. Your touch to this person is like no other. And this person doesn't want to let this go. No, they don't. Show me this divinely guided spirit. Oh, wow. The other. The other person I'm seeing is influencing my decision. For some of you guys, you are in something third party. And then we have youthful. Let's keep an inner child ages and maintain youthful forever. Some of you guys, whoever this person is, if you're in something third party, you're the younger person. And then we have love, hate. I'm angry, but I still love you. Just hate what you do. I feel like that's you. I feel like that's you for someone here. And it could be someone for you as well. But I'm definitely getting some different, different energies here. Who is this past person, spirit? This person that wants to come in? Who's this person that's trying to leave somebody? Like this person is trying to leave somebody, trying to free themselves so they can come to you. Who is this person that wants this reconciliation with my Virgo? Who's this person that wants to be intimate with my Virgos again? Hmm. 
we have the what is this knight of pentacles virgo taurus capricorn energy this is somebody here that you're not giving it to anymore and we also have the knight of chalice cancer scorpio pisces energy this is two different people this is two different people for some of you guys you got for some of you guys you got two different people from your past that still wants to still wants to play with you we have a knight of pentacles virgo taurus capricorn this is somebody here that it's like these people are not ready though these people are not on your level and they're not ready and this knight of cups cancer scorpio pisces energy this person is very emotional this is this could be somebody that cries during sex or somebody that's a crybaby about it all this knight of pentacles is somebody here you still give it give it it's like you give more to this sexual encounter than this person you give more to this intimate encounter than this person you got one person that's all emotional and lovey-dovey and then you got one person that it's like i'm getting like they have the tools but do they know how to do they know what to do with those tools yeah strong energy strong energy who is this true love i feel like that's some new energy who is this true love i felt like doing something a little different then we have the seven of pentacles but i didn't want to i didn't want to make it cheesy or dirty though <laughs> then we got the seven of pentacles here oops so sorry so sorry somebody here it came out in the reverse seven of pentacles talks about like someone here like this is this is giving me someone from a this is kind of giving me someone that you've already dealt with this is give of course because we're talking about in, this is intimate tarot like we're talking about somebody that you've already been intimate with but this is like somebody here that you're ready to give up on you're not sure that you're getting for some of you guys this person that's falling for you this person that's falling for you this person that has fallen for you this person that this true love is about this person that wants to commit to you i'm getting like someone here like you don't really get the return on the intimate that you want or like you're kind of over it like you're kind of like should i keep investing in this i feel like there's an energy of like should i should i keep investing in this i do love this person for some of you guys yes you are committed to this person or you do still want commitment with this person there still is love between you and this person and i feel like that's how this person feels for you but with that seven of pentacles in the reverse this is kind of telling me like this is someone here like that that and this could be this person feeling like they're not getting satisfied the way that they want to be because with the seven of pentacles in the reverse somebody's not being satisfied the way that they want to so while somebody here wants the ring or somebody wants to put the ring on it somebody's still questioning will they will they be satisfied somebody's still questioning will they be satisfied because somebody here doesn't give it as good as they get it somebody here does not give it as good as they get as as good as they get it no who is this person that's thinking who's this person that's thinking about my virgos again in the reverse we have the six of pentacles somebody here i'm telling you six of pentacles in the reverse with the devil strong content uh capricorn energy says contemplation somebody knows some of you guys could be dealing with a capricorn this person's obsessed with you and this person is highly highly attracted to you but with this knight of wands this person oh yeah king of wands this is somebody here that looks good this is somebody here that looks good this person could be older than you gosh gosh who's all these people who is all these people for some of you guys gosh this person that can't stop thinking about you this person that knows that they that like they have to let go of someone this is giving third party this person that's holding on but know they have to let you go but don't want to let you go six of pentacles in the reverse like you're not getting this is like a lack of sad like somebody's not being satisfied here i feel like you're not truly truly being satisfied you're not truly getting what you want out of this connection you're giving way more than you're receiving in this connection this person is highly attractive attractive and highly attracted to you kind of obsessive kind of like controlling too for some of you guys knight of wands this tells me this person is in and out of your life but there is other people in this person's life for some of you guys this could be same sex 
for some of you guys this could be like an older like a, a much older person and for some of you guys you, this you could not this person here you could not know that this person sleeps with the same gender there's a big energy here you could be dealing with an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Taurus, Libra energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn energy. Yeah, there's a big energy of somebody here that sleeps with more than way more than one person. I also get like this person finds you to be extremely nurturing and loving. This person sees stability with you. This person that's thinking, this person sees stability with you. But not only that, I feel like this person has somebody else in their energy that they feel, that's why this person is constantly contemplating. That's why they're constantly thinking about this because they feel some type of way about you and someone else. And I feel like that's why you're not satisfied with this person. I feel like that's why you're not getting that equal give and take. I feel like that's why you're giving. But the thing about it is for some of you guys, this person keeps messing with you because you satisfy this person but i get you satisfying this person more than this person satisfying you intimately i get you satisfying this person way more than this person satisfying you for some of you guys this person could be giving you money or taking care of you financially yeah that's a strong energy that's a real real strong energy show me this balance spirit who is this person that wants to come in and satisfy my Virgos? Strong Libra energy. Who's this? Oh, wow. Okay. Three of chalice. That's your three of cups. Somebody here, again, that's giving me some third party energy. But this is giving me an energy of somebody here that you don't want to mess with anymore. Yeah, justice at the bottom of the deck. Strong Libra energy. For some of you guys, this could be somebody here that you were married to. For some of you guys, this could definitely be somebody here that you are married to. For, yep, Four of Wands. Talks about marriage, relationship, commitment. Now somebody wants to come and do you right. Now somebody wants to come and give you what it is that you want. Strong Libra energy. Now this person wants to come and do right. Now this person wants to come and give you what you deserve. Now this person, like I feel like for a lot of you guys, like you could have tried to encourage more out of this connection with this person intimately and i feel like there's a big energy for a lot of you guys you guys were doing a lot of the work with people here with all these cards in the reverse yeah you were giving so much more in terms of intimacy and passion and caring and nurturing and love giving so much more so much more than what you've been getting yeah show me this divinely guided seven of wands talks about being guarded the chariot so somebody's coming in strong cancer energy with the nine of chalice that's your nine of cups somebody's coming in because they want yes yeah, seven of chalice somebody that has a lot of options somebody knows that you have a lot of options and with justice here yeah ten of pentacles oh yeah and strength so somebody that's been at crossroads i feel like for a lot of you guys whoever you're dealing with whatever synopsis of the stories that's for you whatever synopsis whatever point that is for you there is people coming in for some of you guys you got somebody that doesn't want to let you go from your past for some of you guys there's two people from your past for some of you guys there's someone here that's new that you're not you're questionable it's questionable and i'm also getting like It's not like a, a wow factor. There's a big energy here of like intimacy with this person is not like a wow factor. For some of you guys, you're dealing with somebody here. This person is in it in with someone else. And I feel like the reason why this person can't get past you, get over you is because of the sex. But I do see where this person sees stability with this other person. And this other person could be somebody older that actually takes care of them from what I saw. And then I do have somebody here that wants to, it's like somebody here wants to, it's like somebody here wants to come lay it on you to keep you, 
to kind of keep you stuck, to kind of show you out, to kind of like, you may have had the upper hand, you may have pleased this person, they may have not pleased you. And like, this is this person coming in because they got to show you better than they can tell you. And then there's some of you guys that are being extremely, extremely guarded because you know that somebody here has someone else. You know your worth and you know you're the shit. Big, big energy, big energy. Yeah. All right, my loves. That is what I have for you guys. Definitely let me know. I definitely, I wanted to do something a little different, but I didn't want to make it like overly like too much. <laughs> but definitely your feedback is greatly appreciated. I do love every last one of you guys. Until next time. Bye guys.